right from you know getting your resume shortlisted to receiving the offer letter how has been the complete interview experience for you but the first three rounds as i said it's mostly related to trees linked list do you feel that there has been some enhancement in your problem solving skills i can name like scalar and all this but uh, they were pretty expensive uh, one of my friend joined programming part shala and uh, he has given a very good feedback Hi everyone welcome back to another episode of success stories with programming parshala my name is akanksha and today we have anudeep with us so anudeep has recently gotten placed with cadence as their sde and he has been a working professional since last 3 years of his life he has mentioned everything about his interview journey with cadence as well as his interview preparation journey with renaissance so don't forget to watch till the end of this video and you can also take a free trial from the link in our description section and begin this journey for yourself starting today and let's get into it hi anudeep so happy to have you here how have you been yeah thank you akanksha uh, it's even very great to be a part of this uh, meeting uh, yeah it was very nice experience as of now great theek hai so anudeep you have recently gotten placed with cadence as their sde first of all yeah. congratulations for that we are very happy for you and you. before we begin with this complete interview experience uh, journey of yours can you just tell a bit about yourself my name is anudeep and uh, i did my btech from lovely professional university uh, in punjab uh, okay. so after my btech i joined infineon okay as a intern uh, as a 11 months intern and uh, after that uh, i have come, uh, i continued my employment over there uh, for the last 3 years and uh, yeah now i have moved into cadence recently yeah. that's amazing that's amazing anudeep so coming to your journey to reaching cadence you have been a working professional since 3 plus years as i assume right now yeah so how has been the complete change for you from your previous company to cadence and the working environment how is it for you uh so it's not been uh, long in cadence it's uh, like uh, just a week or so um compared to my old company uh, the tech stack is obviously new and uh, uh, new things we need to learn over there uh, domain knowledge is required mm-hmm. so it's been uh, challenging as of now uh, so even i haven't got the complete idea so Uh, it's in the ramp up phase kind of thing it's in the right. pre stages right now yeah yeah to judge something where it's very quick yes yes it's very okay. yeah i completely agree i completely agree okay and anudeep coming to your interview experience with cadence right from you know getting your resume shortlisted to receiving the offer letter how has been the complete interview experience for you yeah the interview experience was great uh, especially the uh, hr the support from hr is also very nice from cadence and uh, yeah i got this uh, through a referral okay and um, yeah everything got completed within some 10 to 15 days all the uh, there were five rounds of interview and all the five rounds were uh, completed within some 10 to 15 days okay. mm, yeah the first three rounds were technical and uh, the next two were like uh, normal uh, uh, discussion okay okay uh, just a problem solving rounds okay okay could you just give us an idea of how were the questions not exactly even if you can't tell about the question but how were the questions from the topics that they were covering major uh so basically topics if i would say like mostly it would be from ds and algo okay like uh, the trees graphs and uh, uh, the basic algos uh, uh, so which uh, even programming parshala has helped me in that uh, like uh, to ramp up with the basics and all these things because in college um, we have gone through all these things but uh, again um, as i said like i have been in the other company for the three years mm-hmm. in order to brush up the basics and all Mm-hmm. over there um, i got a good help from there and uh, yeah but the first three rounds as i said it's mostly related to trees linked list uh, hashing um, related concepts yeah okay 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 amazing and the last two rounds might be some dhr round and some of your uh, yeah. managerial rounds right 
not exactly it's a kind of uh, the problems or issues they are facing and how our, how our approaches would be in there uh, it's not a complete technical um, uh, not a other way as well like it's a kind of a general discussion in between. Uh, regarding the approaches okay okay anudeep okay great so anudeep uh, you has been a working professional before also but you might have made some changes in your resumes before you you know started applying for other companies are there any resumes tips and tricks that you would like to share with the audience uh, so when i say resume tips like uh, so even in my old company i used to take interviews uh, so when i see some resumes uh, the only thing i would look is like uh, what is the key expertise they have Uh, so if you are bundling our resume with a lot of technologies or a lot of things which we know even it would be uh, not so clear for the recruiter mm-hmm. uh, if we are just focusing on the things which are uh, which were very much perfect uh, or which we uh, know mostly and if we prepare our resume in such a way uh, focusing or highlighting the things which we are well known mm-hmm. then i think this would be helpful instead of having many skills and uh, mentioning many skills you just worked some time long back mm-hmm. uh, i think uh, uh, this uh, this uh, this could be the something which i can tell yeah i believe keeping it fresh and up to date to the information that you are doing yes. current yeah. makes most of the difference i completely yeah. agree completely agree okay and anudeep coming to your journey with programming parshala first i would like to know how did you get to know about programming parshala uh, initially i uh, don't know about programming parshala but um, um i was looking at other things um, which are available uh, if i can name like scalar and all these things um, Mm-hmm. yeah but uh, they were pretty expensive um, uh, so then uh, we were just discussing with the friends like uh, uh, which is the best uh, platform to upskill yeah. ourselves like uh, to brush up our things so then uh, one of my friend joined programming patshala and uh, he has given a very good feedback okay. uh, then i tried for a week uh, there is a one week of free uh, trial which is available so i tried that and yeah uh, then i felt it is very nice uh, so daily uh, i i plan to spend at least uh, some half an hour to one hour either watching videos or um, solving some problems it's not like i'm spending more time but uh, um, at least daily uh, with the current work um, in the evenings or in the night at least if i can spend half an hour or one hour so uh, i tried doing that and uh, it helped me a lot that's great exactly what i was coming to actually you are a working professional and it becomes really difficult to manage your you know life when you have so much of work in your plate and you also have some studying to do there has yeah. to be some type of making up your mind that you have to get up and you have to give one hour or two hours to study every day and do it consistently you did yeah. make up your mind for it were there any hard comes uh, hardships actually that you had to face at any time and sometimes where you might have lacked the motivation and how did you cope up with it it yeah, definitely a few days like uh, within a week uh, like a few days it would be easy to spend some time like uh, an hour or so it would be easy but few days will be occupied with the daily work itself like uh, will be thinking about the issues and spending whole night uh, kind of thing so then it would be really hard because uh, we have a lot of work and we cannot really um, uh, close this and focus on the other things that would be a hard thing and uh, definitely when you lose the face like for one or two days then obviously it will uh, again uh, it would be a bit hard to uh, bring back that again uh, to spend a daily one hour or something like that this is something which i faced in the initial days uh, but now i think uh, i'm uh, used to it yeah. you made it a lifestyle i believe yeah, yeah yeah this is how i plan my day and this is how my play- my day has to go and yeah. that's how you did it amazing and anudeep uh, when you started with renaissance uh, could you feel that there has been some enhancement in your problem solving skills or your dsa skills um, were there any improvement or were they like similar to what you already had mm, uh, regarding uh, the 
concepts it's like concepts uh, most of the things we have seen uh, or uh, we have gone through all those things uh, but the problems related to those concepts uh, solving those problems those are um, a bit uh, kind of tweaked and uh, uh, i i could definitely say like uh, it helped me improving my solving skills problem solving skills yeah okay okay Great, that sounds great, Anudip. Okay, so Anudip, it has been amazing having a word with you. Thank you so much for giving me your time. But before we wind up this interview session and your interview experience with Cadence, uh, is there any piece of advice that you would like to give to our students and everybody watching this video, uh, those who are also preparing to be SDE like you? Yeah, uh, so the only thing what I would say is like uh, people usually get confused like whenever they are trying to get a good platform uh, or when they're searching for a good platform uh, for learning or upskilling themselves. Uh, they might feel like even uh, what I felt was like a uh, programming partial is uh, like uh, the yearly subscription is a bit okay. Mm -hmm. it's not uh, too high or uh, too cheap it's like okay like after discounts and all we'll get for 20k i would say for um, uh, this particular amount like uh, you could uh, for anyone i would recommend that they could blindly spend this amount and uh, uh, spare their uh, time whenever they have in programming partial to upskill themselves uh, because we spend money for many things and we don't even think um, and uh, this is 20k per year and uh, this is for our uh, well-being like uh, for upskilling ourselves so definitely i would recommend programming partial for anyone like who are trying to uh, brush up their skills amazing sounds amazing Andeep. thank you so much for being here and as you have already joined cadence i hope you are having a great time there and i wish you all the luck uh, to be continuing with this thank you thank you very much so i hope you all enjoyed the video in case you did please don't forget to give it a like and also share it with your friends those who are on the journey of becoming a great software development engineer you can also take a free trial from the link in our description section and get on this journey of becoming the amazing sde yourself i will see you in the next video